Hey, what's up guys, Boba Rail here, and today I wanted to take a moment to show off some of the things I found a while back over on ArtStation. These are what I would assume to be some outsourced models that were commissioned by Bohemia in Vigor's early development, and some of these models look very familiar, while others not so much. So let's roll the intro and we'll talk a little bit about these. Alright, so first and foremost, let's look at what you probably clicked on the video for. The Thumper, or as it's known in the real world, the M79. Like I said before, I actually found this on an art station page quite a while back, and I believe my first discovery of it was all the way around Season 4. But because the only explosives in the game at that time were the contact bombs, I figured it would be too far-fetched to assume it could be added. But as I'm sure you can guess, the recent addition of grenades has changed my view on that. And now, all that it would really take to add this gun into the game is to animate it and make its projectile behave like the normal M67s we have right now. Now, for the question of how would you balance something like this, for starters, it would definitely need to be gold, and both the gun and its ammo shouldn't spawn in any unboosted POIs. As for the UI, I'd say remove the green arc that the normal nades have to make its drop less predictable, but also make it have a bit more range than the standard throw. These to me seem like the main steps that could be taken to ensure it doesn't pollute every lobby and would just make it more of a situational weapon instead of a tool for spam. Either way, I don't know. Those are just my thoughts, and if you guys have any other ideas on how a grenade launcher like this could be balanced, I'd like to hear and talk about it more in the comments below. I should also reinforce that none of this is confirmed, this is not official information, and I'm just going off images that I found. While on the topic of this page though, I'm also going to bring up the other gun that isn't already in the game. That gun is the Hungarian AMD-65. This is an assault rifle chambered in 7.62x39 with semi and full auto capabilities. If you couldn't tell, it's pretty clearly another AK variant. Which, in terms of balancing, the AK bracket is pretty full right now, and I'm not sure how they could even add this at this point without having heavy roll overlap with one of the existing guns like the AKM or the AK-74. Although, maybe a higher accuracy but equally high recoil model could fit, so it would be like an AR furniture version to the ZA LMG. Honestly, that's just me grasping at straws trying to figure out how it could fit into the game though, and this video was more just to put these models out there and make people aware of what guns could be coming to the game in future updates. If I had to bet, I'd say that neither of these will be coming with Season 10, and the much more likely candidates for next guns would be the return of the Remington 870, or perhaps the leaked APS pistol I covered in a video a few months ago, which as always, that mentioned video will be linked down below if you don't know what I'm talking about. So anyways, that's all I've got for you guys today. I hope this video was somehow informative. This has been Boba Rail from the Christopher Beast channel, and I'll catch you all in the next one.